Hello, um, this is Max from BFD. I want to quickly talk about some of the different controllers we use here at BFD. This controller is the AeroNav. Um, we're really happy with this. This is from a company called UAV Components. Essentially, it's a, a Panasonic Toughbook in the center, and then you have the uh, control joysticks and switches on the side. This one, as it is right now, is configured uh, with the RFD 900X for telemetry. Um, and then also it has a uh, ethernet jack out here for using uh, tethered, tethered drones. Uh, the great thing about this is it's kind of an all-in-one controller. Uh, some of the other options here, this is a Horus controller. This is our, um, our demo model. So it's got a lot of different switches and uh, whatnot that we use for parachute testing and, and other things. Um, so this is a standard RC remote. And if you're using this, you'd also use a laptop for your mission planning. So this is how your pilot would operate the, the drone. And then if you want to plan any autonomous missions or look at telemetry or anything else like that, use a laptop. And with the AeroNav, it kind of has all of that in one. Additionally, if you're using a micro hard radio or a, silv a Silvus radio, which are two options that you, we also offer, the you can have HD video displayed in your HUD here or on a different monitor. Uh, if you have a different monitor connected to it in, in addition to this. Uh, so th this would be a really nice option uh, for folks who want to have, you know, instead of having a laptop, uh, HD monitor, and a RC remote, uh, they can have just all in one. It has a uh, kind of a, a, a strap harness that you can wear with a four point uh, connection there. So again, the uh, Horus RC controller, great controller, really like this. Uh, it's pretty inexpensive. It's actually standard offering, so it's included in all our aircraft. Um, and then you can put an RFD backpack, which has a wireless connection for your computer. Uh, so you either use your own PC laptop and a Horus controller, or the other option is the AeroNav. We also have been playing around with the HearLink, which is a much more affordable version of something like this. but. Um, it doesn't quite have the amount of expandability and it's still in beta. So for now, uh, these are the options that we offer.